Why are you single? Getting over my last relationship along with commitment issues, childhood trauma, mum, guilt tripping, gaslighting, negative thoughts too man to list. Childhood mental health got carried into adulthood, really messed me up. Because someone peed in the dating pool. My girlfriend passed, and I can't figure out how to fall out of love with a dead woman. Im not smile. I'm not really social and don't talk much to people outside of school. The one time I liked a girl and she liked me even though I loved her, I didn't ask her out or anything because I was too scared. A lot of older married men tell me to stay single for as long as I can. It also helps having the freedom of planning a trip or taking one last minute without the worry of another person's schedule. I'm pretty shy when it comes to talking to girls but I've mustered the courage and I have a fuck buddy so that's cool. Anyways I feel it's better to be single than in a relationship you don't want to be in. I choose to be single. Frankly I could put myself out there, try the dating scene, the whole nine. But in reality, while doing a college education it's just too much unneeded stress. I want to focus on my career first, and get my life stable before I go out to a bar and ruin it. My last BF cheated and I realized love isn't worth it. I know I sound jaded and all that, but none of it is worth my time. People like me, but I'm not special enough to date. I was born that way. My batting average with women is awful lol, plus just don't know where to meet good women. I am 13 years old. I am considered too young to date. And I do not plan on dating anyway. Asperger's is one hell of a thing. Because I am alone. Short and antisocial. Primarily due to looks lol, smiley face. Very shy as a kid, grew up as a UFO, ugly, fat, and odd. Too many ladies want the dig dug meat. Why would I choose only one? BC my crush rejected me and still can't stop thinking about her. I live in a van and like to travel. All my past relationships didn't work out, so I'm living life on my terms. I will prob give relationships another shot down the road. Because I'm autistic, I'm literally incapable of carrying on a proper conversation. Being single allows me time to really find when I'm ready as well as I tried multiple times previously and so it's been hard to regain the confidence to keep a relationship. Also when I'm single I can check out people I'm interested in and hope maybe one day I'll gain some confidence to talk to them. Also I suck at talking to girls unless I am just friends with them. Also I have messed up friendships from them not wanting to associate with me after a relationship. So if the true answer lies in the fact I don't want to ruin good relationships. By complicating things. I don't like arguing. Don't have the looks or personality. Shrug. I'm 13. My ex-wife needed to experience single life after getting married too soon. I was collateral damage. Subhuman looks. Cuss no one likes me. Because I was abused psychologically by a former partner and save my emotional batteries for trusted friends and my child, instead of taking a chance again. Maybe I will go looking when my kid is living on her own. Because I'm ugly and I'm proud. I'm trans MTF still not done with transitioning and I like girls. I've only ever had one GF who was bisexual and very supportive of me, even saying it's perfect I prefer girls anyways but due to circumstances out of our control, it ended. Ever since, I feel like it's hit me now that I'm single that I worry too much about my male features so I lost all my confidence in trying to find a girl to date because I'm really self-conscious about it and feel like I don't deserve it until I'm fully done with transition. I'm RO. Despite my attempts to interact with and get to know girls better, I'm just bad at socializing. And even those who I manage to chat with it whole never goes that far. Or at least it hasn't yet. I got a few options but I don't think they know me enough to like me. TLDR, I'm asocial and extremely introverted. It's just easy. I'm 14 and on summer break. Trust me dude I want a GF too. Well I'm kind of young to be dating right now. Oh. There are many reasons. 
one im fat two im bald three shit night shift job four can't afford car five self centered three of these can change well girl have ever complimented me being pretty so i guess i'm fucking ugly plus i'm asian guy i can't really date european because of social race with my poor social skill it get worse also it doesn't help that i'm too nice like i don't have strong personality but this September I will go to college and I hope meet some people. I don't want to deal with the aftermath of a relationship. Every love story ends in tragedy if you wait long enough. I'm bitter. I'm in the early stages of my military career, I'm taking it easy for a bit. Planning to move to a different country to work for a couple years. Not sure if I can handle long distance relationship. Also want to experience starting a new life in another country as a single individual. So if it's meant to be, the universe will have us cross paths once slash if I move back. I tend to be attracted to PPA who I know are not fit so I keep a distance. I'm working on it. I'm a 16 year old who wastes his life on video games. I'm not but I should be because I love dick. At first because I couldn't get in a relationship at all. Now it's because I don't want to. Very overweight. Was better off a while ago but gained it all back after last relationship. Basically preventing myself from even thinking of looking unless I can get myself to a reasonable weight. Hasn't been going well lol. I don't exercise. I spend the bulk of my time smoking weed and playing video games. I'm unemployed. I have low self esteem. I have unreasonable standards. Because apparently no one's interested in a single, never married slash no kids guy who owns a small winery in Northern California, and has a house and university degree. I'm like 5 tenths on a great day. My personality is okay. Not great not bad. It's also just hard to date in your late twenties. My options are stepdad or a girl the size of a minivan. And even with those options most of them wouldn't pick me. Social anxiety and no time. Cause I'm so unhappy with the person I am at this moment. I can't allow myself to drag other down with me as long I haven't recovered. My ex came out as trans and we decided it's best if we end it. They were a female who came out as a trans male. I game. I deliberately sabotaged nearly all of my chances at relationships in the past and chose a secluded lifestyle which resulted in me being unfit in a relationship. Too many reasons to count. Cause that's the way I like it. Uh huh. Just need to keep trying. Had a date last Saturday. The first one I've been on in 10 years. By popular demand. Fear of having a future with someone else and end up being left and having to co-parent with two different women with two different children. I make friends and then push them away in fear of being a burden. Also I'm too ugly and more importantly generally unlikable. I have some theories but I'm not really sure. I don't know why nobody cares about me like that or ever has. I don't have enough to offer to attract someone I'd be attracted to. Too busy. X and I both had a lot going on in our lives and decided the time wasn't right. Wish nothing but the absolute best for her. Just sucks that it didn't work out. I got fucked so goddamn hard in my divorce. I never really realized how much power somebody could have over my life just because I loved them at one point, and I will never give that power to someone else again. Cause I need to stay away from people cause even though I don't like to admit it but I suck as a person smile. I don't try. I've convinced myself that I'd fail if I ever tried to date, plus, I'm unattractive, unmotivated, poor, and live with my parents. I just figured, I wouldn't want to date me so why would anyone else? I'm aware putting myself down like this makes it worse, yet I still do it. Regardless, I'd have to fix myself and grow to like myself before I could ever have the confidence to date. Last time I was in a relationship I had to spend 6 months in the hospital with no way to contact my at the time boyfriend. Now finding it difficult to meet new people with my disability, amnesiac, I've acquired. Look at all those chittens. Covid-19 fucking heavy sigh. Because I'm not mentally stable yet. Oh honey because it's amazing. 
because my last girlfriend abused me and now I lack the minimal ability to flirt without being stupidly insecure. Ugly gang. So many reasons. Because I always turn them down or not even try because none of them release a spark in me. I find many different kinds of PPSO attractive, but not for me. Because I'm not good enough. Terrible personality.